All right, well, how do we learn tax law? So you're gonna, you're gonna wanna question the law, you're gonna wanna reason with it, you're gonna wanna debate it. In other words, you don't really wanna learn tax law or anything by just trying to rogue memorize it. You don't just, you're not gonna be able to just repeat the tax law enough times so that it's stuck in your head by repetition. It's too big of something uh, to be able to do that. And even if you were able to do that, you don't really develop any conceptual understanding of the tax law because oftentimes there's there's gray area just like uh, with any type of law and when you're learning anything the general uh, idea of learning it is going to be tell a story about it and even when you're talking about learning a series of numbers then oftentimes if you can break those numbers into a pictorial format you can make a picture you can you can link the number to an image and then make a story about those images that's going to help you to basically remember just even a series of numbers. So just from a practical standpoint, when you're learning the tax law for whatever you want to do, you want to make a story about it. Fortunately, the tax law already has a story because everything that the tax law has been put together, someone put that together because they thought it was a good idea, right? They've been arguing. It's a, it's a process that came out of a, you know, a, 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 the creation of the law. Arguments have happened and this thing uh, came out of that. So the question is, you can ask questions like, well, what were they thinking when they put this law in place? Do I agree uh, with the law that was put in place? Now that this law is put in place, what are the incentives that that's gonna have? Is that gonna incentivize people to grow the economy? Is it gonna incentivize people to reduce the economy? Is it okay that the economy is being possibly depressed in some way or reducing GDP if we can get a more even distribution through redistributional policies and th these kind of questions are things that you will see if you if you start looking at the at the tax law and it's just like any kind of text that you engage with if it was like a philosophical text or something like that you're going to be reading it and say why why does this person think that you're going to like debate and and you don't just like just read it and just kind of take it in well that's what that person thinks i'm not going to question it or uh if you're th if you're looking at books like the Homer or Shakespeare or something, you're gonna be asking questions like, well, why did Achilles do that? He's acting like a baby. I don't know what he's doing over here. You're gonna, you know, you're gonna question the, the motives of the characters. Well, the characters in tax law are the people that put in the law. And so we can, we can basically ask questions in terms of why those laws have been put in place. And then, and then that will help us at least with the memorization of it it will also help us to engage it when we're actually trying to do things uh, with the law. And if we have clients or are working with people that are interested in, in the law, you have something to actually talk about. You can give some opinion as to not just what the law says, but possibly what the incentives or motives were behind it. Now that could get you in trouble because people have different, different opinions about what is fair. If you just say, we want a fair tax code, that's a pretty safe thing to say and off, almost evasive thing to say, right? What the, the, it's, it's, if you actually get into the details in terms of what you think is fair and those kind of questions, then you're gonna annoy people sometimes, but those are more honest uh, debates. And so, so, and there'll be more, more engaging debates with the clients. And if you engage in more engaging debates, you might have more clients that actually hopefully you you genuinely agree with which would be a a better a better <laughs> system usually uh if, if that's possible but in any case that's the idea